Um, I grew up in a household where my um, father is a physician and my mother is a nurse. And so um, as an only child, dinner conversation sometimes was them talking and me listening about their day. And I, I brought my cabbage patch to my mom at age three saying my baby doll had a stroke. And my parents thought maybe they should back off on the conversation. So I think from an early age it was formative for me. Um, but I ended up um, shadowing my dad, shadowing some other people in middle school and high school and really seeing that medicine impacts lives in meaningful ways and that I wanted to do it. When did you know this was the field, this was the direction you wanted to go? <clears throat> that was a little more winding of a path. Um, I liked everything when I was in medical school, going through each rotation. On each rotation, I wanted to be that specialty. So, um, you know, I wanted to be an orthopedic surgeon for a little while. I wanted to be a trauma surgeon for a little while. Um, and then I was on a rotation um, for trauma surgery, and I really fell in love with the, the critical care aspect. So that's part of my job, too, is working in our ICU, taking care of patients. And I quickly realized that having that more lasting relationship could be obtained in pulmonary. Um, so I could see them in the office, take care of them, and see them in the hospital. So about my fourth year of medical school, I realized that that's what I wanted to do.